Hello friends, it's success. So our 3D printer started printing. So I'm printing a cube of 20 by 20. You can see the first layer is completed. I'm very happy with the output also because first print it is printing my beyond my expectation. So we designed 3D printer using PVC. For this PVC uh, pipe, we used 400 mm length two pipes and 370 mm six pipes. Okay. So we need two T bits and uh, six L bits. Okay. So along with that, we already printed the 3d printed parts which are designed in system so let's assemble first i am going to assemble the bed frame so for this we have 370 mm two pipe have to take the t so i have to insert like this next 175 mm two pipes for this one is tensioner y axis tensioner part and two y axis holder okay next two elbows fix like this end to end after that similarly we fix this stepper motor y axis and two numbers y axis rod holder ok next take elbow assemble like this ok now the y axis almost come to end so our y axis is ready we have to maintain 120 mm distance between the two y axis rods that will we use screws for mounting this holders then we match the exact dimension which is required for two uh, y rods ok next keep it aside now two numbers z axis holder so for this we have 400 mm pipe in length and 370 mm two so we have to insert like this and this 470 400 mm pipe goes in the right side of this lug holder next similarly we put 370 mm 370 mm and 400 mm so our z axis is almost come to end so it is upper holder I have to insert like this for both it is similar ok now so 45 mm two pipes for this we assemble our y axis and z axis frame ok so 
it goes here and the tape similarly it goes to z axis holder and the tape so everything is should be gummed or use gum uh, for the pvc pipe or you can use the screws so i am showing the fixing how to fix we assemble our frame of 3d printer using that pvc pipes okay that's this elbows goes here and here okay then this is 315 mm pipe goes on the top side of the frame so the y axis and z axis frame assemble is complete our 3d printer frame y axis and z axis frame is completed so move on to next